Here we are. Now, we're going to have some fun right now because IT John is sitting in there helping Michael out because Michael is uh, going to run the uh, TriCaster. Hey, Michael. Go, there you go. You didn't even let me ask you to go to the other camera. Boy, I'll tell you. And he's back at me. You hang? Yes, I am. You remember me, Hank? You, I remember. Come on over here. I saw you yesterday. Yes, you were at the bar and we talked about your son. Probably. Well, okay, probably. Yeah, because I came that, out here to stage with you. Yes. Hey, that was so, me, man. That was you. So tell everybody who me is. Hey, I'm Nancy. I'm one Wait of the bartenders. What? Okay, what is this? You're cleaning We've it up? We've got tire shine. We've got multi-purpose cleaner. Bunch of smell good stuff for the bike. Oh, all right. I you got it all. Wait a minute. You mean to tell me you got to put something good on your bike to make it smell good? Well, I'll probably put that on my Mustang. Oh, that's what, all right, yes. <laughs> yeah. We're we having have a the great same time. Problem. We have the same problem. If you look back in there, first of all, you'll see yourself. You're live right now. Hi. And, Hi. and, um. Hi, me. And, and basically, our van smells so bad. Let me have one of those. You want one of those? Yeah, yeah. Van? Yeah. There you go. All right. So now the van's going to smell good. So tell everybody, I, this is. American Legion Post 10. American Legion Post 10. And? Armed Forces Day. Come out and celebrate with us. Go until 7 o'clock. And now, I was in here yesterday. Yes, you treated you me like royalty. So I really, first of all, I want to thank you. And then, well, you got, and then you got Jeff. And we came over and we shot a little commercial. Yes, we did. And we had some fun on that. Yep. So I heard, now you, and, and I don't want to speak out of turn. So you got to let me know. Okay. Right, that. If someone comes, they can sign in, and yes. you will let them in. I will sign them in. They can come into our post, check it out, see what it's all about. If they're eligible to join, we can certainly sign them up anytime. They just need a DD-214, they're in. All right, everybody. If nothing come else, in. you got to come over and look at this post. It's been here, what did they tell me, 19? No, 100 years. 100 years, 1919. 100 years we have been in the same location. So, and it's on the lakefront. I mean, they Beautiful. have got the, they got, this is probably the best. It is the best location. Uh, of, of all the legions I've ever been to. It's beautiful. Can't beat it. And you got some beautiful people inside. Great bartenders. We love us all. All right. Well, thank you, dear. Hey. Right. And maybe later I'll, I'll let the band come in. The come band? In. These guys come in. All right. We will do it. All right. All right. Did you bring beer? All right. All right. Put the beer right here. Can you get the table, John? All right, now, John's our tester. Okay. Okay? John, oh, come on in. Supposed to bring little cups? Try it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. <laughs> Talk to John. John, come on in. Yeah, yeah. That's John. Distributors, and we distribute Boricua beer originally and Taino light. Uh, we have them in all the supermarkets in the area, like Bravos, Sedanos, uh, Unidos, and Fresco y Mas all in right. the Central Florida area. And now we've just launched a new beer. Today is our first day. That, that's what I heard. With yeah. Salute Beer, and Salute Stars and Stripes donates two dollars to a veterans nonprofit organization with every case that we sell. All right. Okay. Well, uh, you see that guy right back there? Hi. That's Michael. Michael, he does the USO stuff here Excellent. in the city. So Excellent. he's going to have a ride also. Nice to meet you. And here's the neat thing, uh -huh. OK? That's his first time on that machine. Oh, and, wow. And, and he doesn't know how to put your name up. Oh, OK. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to yeah, just yeah. go up there and show? Yeah. <laughs> so what, well, we're getting ready. Come on out, dear. 
You'll do the grand opening. Okay, we're going to wait until wait wait, wait. John comes back. Yep. He wants to put your names up there. Okay. And we'll see how this works. First time on the machine. That's great. So, all right, well, I'm going to tell the story mm -hmm. because your place was right next to where my office used to be. That's right. And I used to drive by and see your truck every day. <laughs> And you would drive in the first driveway, and your truck would be sitting right there. Uh -huh. So, look, there you are. How's that? Yeah, Great job, Michael. <laughs> Good job. You're hired. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so he's our beer connoisseur. Okay. Okay. Excellent. And the other guy isn't here, so he'll oh, substitute yeah. every day for him. Okay. Oh, All right, yeah. so he gets two shots. He right? gets everything. <laughs> so, let's talk about this beer first. Tell me a little okay. bit about it. So Boricua beer is a Caribbean amber. Okay. It's very rich in flavor, and it also is very good to to accompany food because it brings out the taste in the Wait food. Wait a minute! You brought the bottle of no many, food. <laughs> <laughs> many ladies love it. I'm the food. <laughs> <laughs> the ladies actually love it. Okay. And it, but it has a six percent alcohol. Okay. Content. So I, like I don't know right. why we really like it. Ready to break it? <laughs> break it open. It's my personal favorite. Your personal favorite. Yeah. Okay. We'll start with him. You notice we didn't bring the little cups. Yeah. Okay. And I'll try a little. A little. That's good. Yeah, because we might have to save some for. Oh. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Salute. 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 Yeah, it's a nice craft. I want beer. a cheeseburger. French fries. French fries. And your opinion? Oh, well, this is good. He likes it. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's a craft beer, so it's a lot more flavor. Now, are you nationwide? No, we're actually Tampa, Central Florida. Uh, we're not in South Florida yet. Okay. We're hoping to be. So how did you get into the, to the beer business? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I don't know what happened. I was trying to sell radio and advertising to Danny. And I became a salesperson, and then I started running the distributorship. I don't know how it happened. <laughs> so you run the distributor for Central Florida or yeah. all of Florida? Uh -huh. Central? Central Florida. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good. Yeah, it is good. We are allowed to, you know, cover the whole Florida area. We are licensed to distribute in all of Florida, but we're growing slowly. Well, I'll tell you what, we that's not bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to save this one for later. Yeah, okay. Okay, tell me about this one. Okay, so that's your uh, lager. I won't let it fall. <laughs> I'm nervous. Uh huh. That's your lager, yep. and it's a 4.5. Okay. It's um, lighter than the other one, of course. All it's right. Got a little bit more bitterness. Bitterness. Mm -hmm. okay. That's mm -hmm. him. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm so, the sweet guy. Go ahead and open it. Who's our assistant? Yeah. Our assistant is Maria Virginia. Yeah. Victoria. Maria Victoria. Victoria. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm just, this is my first day. I hope I'm doing fine. You're doing uh, great. Uh -huh. You know That's what? Great. Yeah, we wouldn't know that this was your I first know. day. Uh -huh. So you're Very doing good. all right. That's good. All That's right, good. I'll pour this one right. for you. We got to save a little. Mike, yeah. you want to drink out of a bottle? No? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> all right. Salute. Salute. Yep. That's got more of a head on it. Maybe it's because I didn't clean out the old beer. Probably. This, you can taste the bitterness, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But men prefer that this, one. This will go with a steak. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Definitely. So so far you owe me a cheeseburger, fries, and, and, and a, a steak. steak. Yeah. <laughs> or tacos. I like tacos with that one. <laughs> Talking about, you know what my favorite place is? You ever been to Don Julio's? Don Julio's, no. Oh, you got to go there. Where the is best, that? Well, they got a couple of yeah, them around, the but they, uh -huh. uh, um, I'm trying to think. Um, Don Julio. Yeah, you'll have to look it up. Okay, I'll look it up. We go there every Sunday. Really? See you really? Oh, up every see Sunday. See you tomorrow. Ah. <laughs> That's right, tomorrow's. I lose tomorrow's track Sunday. <laughs> they have the best. Really? Oh, I'm telling you, it, it's like every day I go get something different. Oh, okay, and you like everything. Uh, so far, I haven't had a bad meal. Excellent, <laughs> so excellent. That, that's that's a really good restaurant. Maybe you can get then. Your beer in there. Yeah, we'll try. I'll give it a shot. Why not? All right. Okay. Very good. Now, mm -hmm. the next one. You told us is that you're debuting it today. Yeah, we're debuting it today. Is we decided to do something for the veterans, okay? 
and we came up with Salute Stars and Stripes Craft Beer. Okay. Yep. Uh, and we're donating two dollars to a nonprofit organization uh, that helps veterans once they come back home. All right. Okay. Uh, veterans that with disabilities. Super. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm trying to think. Like, so we work with Mich Mission 22. Mm -hmm. Mission, Mission 22. Mm -hmm. Every day, 22 vets commit suicide. Oh my God! I know. Mm -hmm. And so we work with them, and, and what we're trying to do is get that number down. Down. So that excellent. You know, but mm -hmm. I mean, there's there's so many groups out there that yes. need to help. Yes. Help exactly. So. And 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 we're and we're not going to focus on just one. So right. and we have around. variety. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, spread it around Perfect. definitely. Um, we wanted to do a Boricua beer light, but then the idea came up. And we decided it was a better idea. Okay. <laughs> Where do you brew your beer? Our beer is brewed in Cape Canaveral. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. You go over and watch your lunch and get happy. Uh -huh. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. I like there you go. Go. We can have a happy uh -huh. party. Uh -huh. yeah. And actually, this one was brewed by Keelan Curley in Lakeland. I don't know who they are, but uh -huh. congratulations. <laughs> They're a winery. <laughs> They're a winery? They are also, also brew beer. All right, let me finish this and we'll crack that one. Yep. Uh huh. And then you drive you home. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> ready. Oh, this one's much lighter. Yeah, I was going to say, you can. Very summery. That's good. I have to yeah. drive. I have oh. to designate a driver. It's more of an IPA. Okay. If I had to pick uh -huh. the way I would go, uh -huh. I would go one, one two, two, and three. three. I'm not the bitter one. Yeah, yeah, I know. But, but some people like it. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, no, that's what yeah. I'm saying. It's, it's, a, you, it's you that like personal those. taste of mm -hmm. what you like. Mm -hmm. yeah, we I need to do this more often. Definitely. When we, every time we go yeah. somewhere, we'll tell you where we are. Okay. Yeah. And you know what we could and do? And I'll send her. Yeah. <laughs> you know what we can do? <laughs> we, we could cover them. Yeah. And have people taste, taste them and say, yeah. which one do you like? Uh -huh. And then we'll see, you know. Yeah, yeah. that'd be nice. Yeah, yeah. good idea. Mm -hmm. I, like I usually, it. Um, yeah. I, uh, what do you call it, cover their eyes? Yeah. yeah. I well, blindfold well, them oh, and then I, I pass oh, yeah. them which one's the light and which one's the regular. Really? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> this is good. My wife's going to go, you've been drinking while you're supposed to be working? No, I was no. working testing. Yeah. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. You might Very be watching important. now, too. So. Oh, we have another tester. <laughs> Here you go. We've got, we've got a third oh, cup for a reason, right? We got, we're having a, a little cat. tiny bit. Oh. All right. I got to say. Focus. You can go. Yeah, let me know Just like that. About five minutes. Okay. We're going to go on. You're gonna Thank that's, you so that, much. That's Jeff. Jeff's the one that oh, took Jeff. the sound. Oh, that's right. He's doing the sound. Yes. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, no. Right, right, which right. one's your favorite? My favorite. I'd have to say. Really? Oh, you like that one okay. better? Okay. A bitter girl. <laughs> bitter girl. And which one is yours? No, I like the body Do you? I like yeah. the body I tried this one for the first time today. Did you? And I liked it. It's it's good for I like like events like yes, this, right, like where right, you're just right. walking like, around. Like that's good with food. Exactly. Like yeah. we're gonna have dinner. I'll yep. have this one, yep. definitely. But if I'm gonna be out in outdoors and stuff, then that one. Well, next mm -hmm. time we're here, we'll have John and John. <laughs> uh -huh. That's IT John. Uh huh. And we have Crazy John. Crazy John. Yeah. Oh, and I wanna meet Crazy John. Well, well. <laughs> everybody, everybody. <laughs> Most of the time he sleeps up on top. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know if I got a picture of this. And he doesn't fry? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Up there. yeah. But, um, well, it's up on Facebook. If you go up on Facebook, mm -hmm. a photographer took a picture of him and his wife sitting there pretending they're working, drinking beer. Yeah. Pretending out of the trophy. Out of the trophy. Oh, out of the trophy. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So it was great. Well, maybe next time we can do a contest of... Who well, drinks a full trophy? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, he's had practice. You, you, uh -huh. you have our number? No, I don't. Oh, yes. Oh, you you got to me. Yes, okay. I got your card. Definitely. Right. I remember If you now. can't reach me by email, uh -huh. call me. I will. And let's get together. I'll let you know that when we're doing something again. Okay. And then when you can come down and maybe we'll run a taste test because I know bikers will like to, you know. Yes, like, definitely. Oh, free beer? I'll yeah. be there. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Sounds good. Sounds Appreciate good. Appreciate it. Uh -huh. And thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you. Really love it. Enjoyed it. Thank you. Nice meeting you guys. Yep. Okay. Thank you, Bye. dear. Thanks.
You're doing a great job back there. All right, now we got somebody coming out. Look, he's running the camera. Oh my God. You get union dues? Come on. You got both of you? Come on on. I got your name. This is Ben, but I don't know you. Jean Levois. Oh boy, you're gonna kill me with that. Sean? Jean? Jean Levois. You from like Louisiana? No, I'm from Haiti. All right, I'm just there. Very nice. Yes. How long ago? 30, 20, about 25 years ago? Close, close, close. Yeah. Um, where you going? Oh, don't trip. Let's see how we're lined up. Okay, just go over a little bit. Right there, okay, that's good. That, that's uh, Mike back there, it's his first day at <coughs> First day? First day, first day. whoa, there goes our beer. Um, and and uh, IT John is training him. So we had to learn how to drink beer today. It was a tough job. I mean, somebody had to do it, you know? Can I learn? Yeah, you missed it. <laughs> I noticed the bottles are gone. So tell me, Ben, I just met you a while ago, and I met you because my buddy over here, look at this, zero, zero, comes walking over, and we start talking. And this is the neat thing about going to places like this. You meet new people, you find out new things that are going on, and you can spread the word. So I'll start with you. And I gotta apologize because you know I'm gonna John. just I know, but you don't say understand. Jin. Say Jin to my crazy. Say Jin. Jin? Jin. Jin, okay. Because I'm dyslexic. I don't know if you know what that is, but I reverse letters and numbers. Get to backwards. I won't be offended. Well, I just want yes. <laughs> Please don't. So anyhow, you and I were talking, and you you're like the man about all over. So tell me all the different things that you do. Wow. Well, you know, uh, we get a little older in your business, uh, years and years, 45 years in the business. You know, it's day by day. You remember the first day you started, and uh, it's just, uh, you know, you keep going that you're motivated, and, you know, you learn with time. Okay, and you're from Brooklyn. I am Brooklyn born and bred. Really? I didn't know you were born there. <laughs> Outstanding. It's a giveaway. It's a giveaway. Jim. Yes, sir. You are from Haiti. Yes, definitely. Okay, what city? A poor place. Okay, I went to Port of Prince, and that's where I was. And, and when, then don't take this wrong, but when I went there, everybody thought I was in the CIA. <laughs> I swear to God. At that time, it was a rough time. Oh. It was a rough time. Yes. And so we went there, and we went to pick up a, a plane that somebody had left. And I lived in the Virgin Islands at the time. And Papa Doc. His brother wanted that plane, and we couldn't get off the island. Yo, it was something else. Stop this, stop yes, this. Yes, but we made it. We made it. So tell me about you. I see you got a badge over here. Ah, uh, yes. To, to make it fun, I can tell you last time I was nominated as sheriff of, the, of this county. All right. That's a joke. That's a joke. All right. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I can tell you that six months ago, I joined Ben. Yes. Is a real estate book and film, and I have learned a lot so from him. Because beside the real estate practice that he's doing, he also involved in mortgage banking. Okay. That's another side of real estate I'd never learned. So and then so far, I've experienced a lot for, from him. So now, do you sell real estate in Florida or in New York or all over? Basically, we are we are partners all over the country. Okay. But we are located and we are in, in Brooklyn, New York. Okay. So you brought him on. You must be doing all right. You brought him here. God is good. Uh, God is good. That's I love that. So, when you and I talked, we talked a little bit about, you know, mortgages and stuff. And I'm not a big mortgage guy. And, and I, I'm selling my house. Okay. As a matter of fact, two people looked at it today. I, I hope one of them buys it. But I'm getting ready to move to Georgia, and I was going to pay cash. Now you tell me why I shouldn't pay cash and I should do a mortgage. Well, you know, a lot. If you go to an accountant, all of a sudden, uh, you know, you. Your spouse is working, she's an RN. You know, you got a good position, you're with a company, you're earning dollars, you're putting dollars, you know, on the tax return. And then you say, hey, you know what? We're making $100,000 a year, but yet, uh, you know, uh, I'm coming home with half of it. Yeah, I've seen that. <laughs> so then you go to your account and say, what can I do? And the biggest deduction, uh, you know, on the planet is, is your home. Mm -hmm. Now there's a pity, what we call pity. 
Pity is the P-I-T-I. Everyone should learn about it a little more. It stands for Principal Interest Taxes and Insurance. And that's the payment you're going to send to the bank. You're going to send the principal, the interest, the taxes, and insurance. The only thing that's not deductible is the principal. Really? Everything else is deductible. Now, you know, that, uh, I know we said 50 grand, but you're going to take a little more home. You may take home in that bracket 65000 The other 35000 is going for taxes. So that 10 grand that's going to come back as a savings, as a deduction that's going to come back to you, yeah, you okay. can put back into the mortgage. You can keep writing things off. And there's, in a home, there's uh, one of the best deductions, capital gain with capital gains. Okay. What is capital gains? Capital gains, the definition is profit. Profit equals income. Income you pay taxes on, but the home, if you make 250000 and you're a single person, there's a one-time tax exemption under the 1997 Tax Relief Act that you get a benefit of $250,000. Okay. And two yeah. people... Oh, we come on right in here. Go. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. You on just in. missed our live camera right there. I'm going to let you go right here. There you go. And a husband and wife is going to get a $500,000 exemption. So okay. there's many, many uh, advantages and benefits. Just because, you know, you think the house is paid off, no one wants a payment, but you have to work, you learn how to work the system. All right. I, I would like to add one single thing on what well, I've Ben. More than one. I, 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 on what Ben already said. Yeah. If you can qualify for a mortgage, why you pull out all cash and buying one? You can spread that money and buy more than one. And then you can be qualified for your to buy one. You can become an investor by buying two or three. All right, here's what's going to happen, okay? When I sell my house, I'm going to call you guys. I'm not, I'm not guaranteeing I'm not paying cash. I might pay half, half on the house and then half on a mortgage, something to that effect. <laughs> But, you know, if I'm going to make money, then I'm interested. I, I, I got another thing to add. The business person, uh, the journalists here, the uh, producers, directors, and all that. If you're going to get this cash from when you sell your home, and you did put half down, and you did something else, you to grow your business, or said, you know what, I hear about these foreclosures. Maybe there's a good deal. Maybe there was the neighbor next door. The house needed work. And you said, why don't I just buy this? And I buy that one for cash. I'll fix it a little bit, and I'll resell it. That's what's happening around the country. Okay. Money makes money. You taking your money and putting it into the home, you're tying up all your money. All right. All right. Well, one thing I could add for you. I am here. I represent two communities. The French communities and then the Creole communities. You know that New York is a hub. So as I speak French Creole on top of English, so now I got I got the opportunity to work with more a more diverse population. Okay. All right. Well, I got a house that's uh, listed for just five ninety five. Come on in and uh, sell it for me. <laughs> <laughs> Love to. We're gonna work it out. All right. Out. All right. Sounds good. Uh, sounds good. To. Now, who's this beautiful lady we got between us here? Melissa Perez. And if it wasn't for her, we wouldn't be here today. All right. Thank you. I appreciate that, Ben. Yes, I think this is an awesome company. This is an awesome opportunity that they're here in Orlando, all the way from New York. So they're expanding operations here in Florida. And I'm very happy with them. Also, I think this is a very good opportunity for millennials to, because a lot of millennials right now are opening businesses. You'll be surprised how many young people are interested in opening uh, small businesses, businesses, and want to move forward with this. They don't want to, they're entrepreneurs. They don't want to work that eight to five anymore. So this company here can uh, uh, help you, uh, help the millennials that are, uh, you know, expanding right now. That's what, that's the new movement, you know, get their thing going. So, you know, they, they should call us and give us a call. See, I, see I'm going to tell you now, I taught school for a long, long time. I'm, I'm a school teacher by trade, retired. You should put on clinics. I have to call you up because I'm going to tell you, the, people, the kids that are coming out of school for the last 19 years, 
really don't understand. They don't know how to write a checkbook. They don't understand interest rates. They don't understand, you know, oh, look, I'll put it on this credit card. Next thing you know, they got a credit card that they'll never be able to pay off. But you should put on clinics once a month, once a quarter, and invite people into your office and sit down and put it on the blackboard and say, look, this is what you can do. And I'll Love guarantee it. you two things. You'll have a lot of people there that don't understand, and they'll go like, wow, really? And you can start these people on the road to success. Absolutely. I can tell you, I can tell you that Ben already has an alternative. First of all, he has a radio show every Tuesday at 92.1 a radio. Well, we could do it, forgive me for interrupting, yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. under one condition, Calvin, <laughs> that he does all the filming. <laughs> I like it. I like it. But like I said, uh, like I said, it's one of these things that I know the people coming up and they have no idea, you know, Yes, what of course, they have to qualify. There's always a process. And because a lot of youngsters, see, you know, you see kids starting jobs from 20 years old. You know, mm -hmm. they actually don't work hard. They, they actually have good credit because they're looking into the future. Yep. So that's also another market that, you know, we can help. Sounds good. I got the, the, the word that I got to bring on my next uh, interview. <laughs> Ben, thank you so much. Thank you. Jim, thank you. Thank you. Thank thank you. you. A pleasure. And Melissa Perez. Per Perez. Perez. Yeah. Yes. My next door neighbor is Perez. Oh. Yes. Yeah, very, uh, very so cool. thank you so much. Thank you. And, and thank enjoy you. yourself. And okay, thank you. Really. All right. All right. I, now. Right there. That Jeff's right out there. You mean that, Jeff? Yeah. yeah. Come on over here, Jeff. Thank you, guys. Jeff. Yeah. All right, everybody. Now, you can tell me if I'm wrong, but you were in charge of this thing. Yes and no. I had help. Well, yeah, I know you had help, <laughs> but there's always somebody that has to spearhead it. Uh, so I took over the project three years ago. Well, I got to tell you, I'm impressed. I like what you got. Next year, we'll see if we can't boost up some of the uh, people coming over to see you. That's what we're hoping. You know, this started, this is our sixth year. Six years ago, it started with two vendors and five bikes and like three kegs of beer. That was it. <laughs> I took over three years ago and we went and had eight vendors and about a eh, hundred bikes or so to here we are now in our sixth year and we've had over 56 vendors here today. Uh, I think the, the, the rough estimate of count 4,600 people have come through today. Wow. And uh, uh, close to 150 bikes showed up. And, and I want everybody to know, it's not just for bikes. No. It's for everybody. You got a band that's going on from 5 to 7. Yep. You yep. had another band come on basically a little after 2 yep. to almost 5. And I called my buddy up who's Hispanic and I go, hey, can you tell me what they're saying? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, it's, it's, I've had a lot of people ask me why, why a salsa band and stuff like that. And it's because you know, one, the community that we live in, yep. obviously, but two, there is a big Hispanic veteran population yes. in this area. So we want to actually, like, uh, <laughs> my wife is walking this way. Uh -oh. She's going to walk on camera. She's Hi, on babe. Camera. How you doing? <laughs> um, you know, so we want to be able to grab that audience as yep. well and let them know, yes, this is Armed Forces Day, but you served in our military as well. We want you to come out here. And well, he's in a band. A, a salsa band. Yeah. He's a Marine. Awesome. And I'm going to give him, you, you're going to have to give me a card because you never gave me a card. Uh, I got to get some more print. Okay. I will. When you do, uh, I'm going to give it to him. And his band has a fairly good following. Okay, cool. And maybe we can get them to come out well, and I'm play also. Well, I'm looking for next year. So, okay. So, yeah, definitely. Yep. Um, you know, I go and I have to laugh because I don't dance. And, you Neither know, do I. But they get over there and they're all, and they go, come on, <laughs> dance. I go, oh, no, no, no. I can't do yeah, you that. Gotta, you gotta, yeah. I can't, I can't do I can that. Do it, I can do it on the table with my foot. Yeah, just do but I, Once I get up there, I lose the beat. How do you lose a Latin beat? I mean, you know, just follow the drum. Exactly, exactly. Yep. But, exactly. I, well, I see that we got rid of the um, the fleece, so that's good. Now yeah, I'm now safe. the party's going to start. Yeah, now we can have some fun. <laughs> no, but you you know put what? them I, right in front of me so that they would watch me. I had to be good. I didn't do that, I promise. Oh, okay. I, I promise. But you know what? I am so glad that they came out. Uh, you know, the guys at Osceola County Sheriff's Department are awesome to us. They take really good care with us, uh, especially KPD. We work hand-in-hand -hand with KPD, yep. the local police. 
Uh, but you know, I love Osceola, your dancer out there. Yeah. <laughs> Osceola County Sheriff, they sent two of their motor units this morning to help That's us escort the I, wall. I, yeah, we talked to the wall people. And they they didn't have to do that, but it was we were so happy that they did. I will say one thing, and that is the Osceola Sheriff's Department, their motor division, go out of their way for anything that has to do with veterans. Oh, ex especially when, you know, in August we do our big uh, Henry Cologne Memorial okay. ride. Uh, it's to honor uh, one of our late riders that we lost last year. Um, actually, three riders now that we've lost, along with the two KPD officers that we've lost and all first responders and everything. And I think last year we had about 300 bikes show up. We go for about a 100-mile ride. Wow. And Osceola County Sheriff's Day, awesome. They come out with about... 10 units and they just stop everybody and we yep. just go and it's great. I will say this, I've been on a lot of escorted rides and the best one I've been on is the ones that they have with the Osceola County Sheriff's people. They, they real, Danny knows how to put it together. Oh yeah. And he oh, just yeah. puts it together and it's really a great ride. Yeah, they're, they're awesome. They're, they're so glad. You know, and I, I just, I want to say for a lot of the vendors that are out here right now that may watch this later, I want to just thank them so much for being here. Because, you know, honestly, a lot of people don't realize the amount of money and effort it takes to put this on. And everyone goes, oh, you're just having a festival. Well, no, not really. Right. A portion of our proceeds are going to Project Vet Relief for our suicide prevention. You know, 22 yep. soldiers a day. It's, that's go. a number we got to break. And I, I just, every food vendor we have out here today is a veteran-owned company. Really? Yes. 70% okay. of all of our vendor booths we have are all veteran-owned companies. And these people came to us. We didn't find them. They came to us. And it's, you know, without them and the community and all, this event, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. If somebody wants to donate to you that didn't come, how would they go about doing it? Do they go to you the can Legion? Go, you can go, you can come down here to Post 10 and, uh, you know, drop a check off for the American Legion Riders. Or you can go on legion.org. And there's a link right there to donate to Project Vet Relief. You can make your donation right there. Outstanding. Well, I got to tell you two things. Number one, yesterday was the first day that I came here. He walked out the door and I was pulling in. So we, we crossed and didn't see each other. <laughs> but the funny thing is that the stage was set up over there. Yep. So I took it upon myself to ride my bike over there. And I'm getting ready to set up. <laughs> he comes running over and he goes, oh, no. Oh no, you can't have that. You can't do that. <laughs> I go, I'll be out of here before they catch us. Oh no, I got a phone call about that one. <laughs> but it's all good. Well, did you see the thing we put up? I, I honestly I haven't had a chance. Well, we put Since it up. I saw you yesterday, I haven't had I a chance to that. stop. But if you go up, you'll see it. You came out, you were even pretty good. It almost like you were comfortable. I well, I do this a lot. All you right, know? sounds I mean, good. I was a performer in the army band, so I'm used to being in front of all different people. <laughs> well, I see that the band's doing well, your vendors are having a good time, and the number you said was about 4,500? About 4,500 is what we got. Let's see if we can double that next year. I would love to. And we'll start pushing it. If you get us information like three months out and come over to the Ace while we're filming, we'll I, talk a I little bit. Will. We'll throw up some footage of, of this one. I mean, people, you got to understand, first of all, it's a great, beautiful place. You got the lake over there great weather oh you couldn't have an event at a better place i mean you know i i, I have to say that i called my brother my, my my brother's here helping me today okay and uh it's funny watching people try to figure out who's who and uh, well he's six foot three and about this big around in his arms you know okay. I, i'm big in the belly area he's bigger up the top and all and i, I told him i said ben I, I need you to make sure there's no rain tonight <laughs> so, so he picked up his cell phone, and he called Odin and Thor and told them all, it ain't going to be any rain, or he's going to swing his hammer, and, and, it's just, and it's been great. It's been absolutely great. Well, I'll tell you what. The breeze, we're in a great spot here. Oh, yeah. And the breeze and everything else is just really nice. So I got to tell everybody it's a little late now because it's uh, yeah, we only a little late. Yeah, we got an hour. Not, so if nothing else, we'll push this on the air on it's up on Facebook, it's up on um, Instagram, awesome. and then we're going to rebroadcast it onto um, YouTube tonight. Awesome. So awesome. it'll go back up we'll on do that. When I sit down and actually take a break finally, kick my boots off after all this, drinking my mojito, I can watch it. Outstanding. I, I'll, be, I'll be happy. And I, you know, one thing, because I, I do have to run real quick, um, you know, 
please, if, if you want to make a donation, go to legion.org, Project Vet Relief. And the big thing is we're pushing it so big this year. This is the American Legion's 100th anniversary, uh, especially our post chapter 10. Or, uh, yeah, I heard me, that this, yes. Yeah. 100 years, June 3rd, 1919, we have been in this location on the lakefront. We're going to do another 100 years, and we can't do it without the support of the community. So, you know, just thank you, thank you, and, and please, just suicide awareness is the biggest thing that we push. So, you know, if you want to donate, legion.org, go on there and donate Project Vet Relief. Outstanding. Yeah. Well, thank hey, you. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Thanks yeah. for inviting us, and hey, we'll we'll come out and do I'm it glad again. You're here. I'm gonna sneak out this way. Okay, sneak <laughs> out that way. All right. Well, everybody, there you go. He was throw it to the outside camera. Let's see how. Oh, look at that. There. Oh, we got the band up there. So the band's working. Um, it's kind of winding down a little bit right now. Come on in here, John. Now. Mike, do you think you can get out here without tripping over everything? Yeah, yeah right. come on. And then we'll figure out how we're going to end the show. I'll throw it, yeah. Now, do me a favor. Yep. We want to get a shot of, of, of over there, so you might want to move the camera a little bit because we need to give a shout out to her. Mike looks like he's dragging. I know. He's, yeah, for in case any of like John and Sean or Rick and any of those guys uh, decide they want to watch uh, Ian and Logan, uh, it went really smooth. We don't care if the camera looked good or not, did we? Nope. We're it, up. We're, we're up. That's right. Yep. So tell everybody where we're up at. We're up on Twitter and Facebook. Okay. And then tonight we're going to try rerunning it on uh, YouTube? It'll be up everywhere tonight. Okay. Yep. Is this also up on CFTV.live? No. Not? Okay. No. Because i got to tell people. The, oh, the Predators game is. Oh, just the Predators. Yes. All right. And the reason i got to say this is because I don't know. I I didn't know that you went to CFTV.live, the, the Facebook webpage. page. Or web page, rather. Yeah. And that everything was on that. So. We were having trouble trying to figure it out. We'd go to Facebook and put it up. Well, yeah, Facebook Facebook will be up. YouTube, the YouTube feed goes to our website. Right, but the thing that, that was funny is you press the button, and instead of CFTV, it would go CCTV. Oh, I know. Yeah, so for it. everybody, you got to work on that a little yep. bit. Yep. So other than that, we're almost getting ready to say uh, goodbye. Yep. So what do you got to say? You going to run in there? Let me, uh, oh, you're going to come back on us. Well, yeah. Yeah. Right now it's Yeah, okay. Well, all those cameras are facing. No, no. We're go facing. To, you want to go over there? In front of the Yeah. We, we, let's see if we'll make it. Oh, yeah. Come out here, dear. I know. We're going to treat you like royalty. After we. Okay. Right now, we're going to come off of the band, and as soon as he points to me, I'll know where we are. He's working, and we're on. Okay. Come on back out. This is the whole crew that worked today. Now, I got to say, yep. all right, everything went smooth except for two things. Why are you laughing? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Well, what two are you going to pick? <laughs> well, I'm going to pick one that somebody dropped a bottle and then I opened it and I got sprayed with coke. But karma is something else because we got a box of ice over there and John decided he wanted to get a piece so he dropped the ice in the bucket and what happened? Water sprayed all over me. Unbelievable. Well, it's a good day for you though. But yeah. the good thing was it was cold. It was cold. Yeah, so I was gonna say it was cold and everything. So. Mike, yeah. I want to thank you personally for everything that you do, including the USO. And, and people don't know, but I, <laughs> if you come up and say hi, you need any help, you've been you've been suckered in, and that's it. <laughs> you, my dear, you're like a trooper. You go everywhere, you do things for us, and I really want to thank you. Okay, so thank you, John. 
I can't tell you how, how impressed I am with all the stuff you do, and somehow we end up on the air. So, for I'm everybody. Following your lead. Oh, don't, don't, don't follow don't my lead. Don't give me any credit. It's all you. No. But this is the crew that put everything on. We're shorthanded. We got up. We did a great job. For everybody out there, thank you so much for watching. If you get a chance, you can go to Armed Forces Day, go to uh, American Legion Post 10, tell them you saw it, and you want to make a donation. And like you said, 22 vets a day commit suicide. And we're trying to lower that number. So help us out, make some donations. And again, thank you for watching. You guys remember our ending? Yep. Okay, now when we end, then John's got to run in and switch. So you'll see us for a little bit. I got one thing real quick. Okay. I want, to say, I want us to do a shout out real quick to Yana. She just came in on the USS Dennis in, to Virginia. Okay. So they just got into port today. Outstanding. And they're in Virginia? They're in Virginia. She John, watching us, I hope? I hope. Okay. All right, we'll see. So, Yana, thank you. All right, here we go. Join the adventure and enjoy the ride. We'll see you next Monday at Porsche night at the Ace Cafe. So if you, if you want to watch us, watch us. If you want to come down, come on down. You'll have a good time. Ace Cafe is always a lot of fun. Thank you, guys. Yep, thank you. I don't know if I should shake your hand. <laughs>